sometimes called Banach Stern Hughes theorem. Right. So the theorem says that let E and F be Banach spaces. read it, let's internalize it, let's see that what does it says. So it says that imagine you have two Banach spaces, okay, and it's a, it's a, it's a, it has a two letter proof, so don't, you don't need to worry, it's not, it's not a long proof, okay. So let E and F be two Banach spaces, and you have a sequence of linear bounded operators from E into F that strongly converges to an operator T. That's what the strong convergence means, you know, point-wise convergence. That it strongly converges to an operator, T, where T is also uh, uh, is, is a linear map from E to F. But, it's, but, but the consequence is this, that this T is not only a linear map in E to F, but it's an element in LEF actually. So it's a linear bounded map from E to F. And this sequence, this sequence must be uniformly bounded as well. So what, what would be the meaning of it? So it's like a, a sequence is also a collection. Okay? So we know that what is the meaning of a collection of linear bounded operators tau, tau. being uniformly bounded. It means that you can find a constant such that okay, you know, the norm of all those are less than or equal to what you call t. Okay? And the norm of this t can be computed R can be estimated by the limits of the norms of the Okay? Sir, this will set me a key tau. You will set all the terms. Then we will apply the theorem. That's what precisely we are going to do. That's what precisely we are going to do. So, what will be the proof? What is the proof? It's a quick two-liner proof. So let F is in E, then we know that T and F converges. Okay? So it converges. So if this converges, okay, converges in F. Alright? 
TNF converges in F. But F is a Banach space. So every convergent sequence is also absolutely convergent. Actually. So it's like, you know, absolute convergence and convergence are equivalent. In Banach spaces, that's what we did yesterday as well. Okay, then, and so the norm of EFF sequence form that, like this sequence of real number is also, is also convergent. Okay. And if this is the case, then the suprema in F, okay, where n is in F is finite. Actually. Why this must be finite? सर कन्वर्जेंट बाउंडेड होती है तो उसका मतलब सुप्रीम हम एक्सिस्ट करेगा we are in the assumptions of uniform boundedness principle actually. Okay? So by so by uniform bounded net principle, what follows is that is what? Okay. Alright. Uh, uniform boundedness principle, the suprema of n in n Tn is also finite. Why this must be the case? Because here you are kind of showing the pointwise boundedness. Okay? But e is since E is Banach space, so it is same so as it's uniform. uniformly bounded as well. At, that's what the uniform boundedness is. Correct. Okay? That's what the uniform boundedness is. Correct. So, uh, we are done with this proof. Okay. So only that we need to show is this guy. So if F is from E such that norm of F is one or less than or equal to one, okay, then then consider this TF. Consider this TF. So this TF is same as limit n goes to infinity TNF. So that's what is given to me. Alright? And the continuity of norm is telling me limit for bar Limit n goes to infinity norm of TNF. Uh, well, I'm going to have this actually. And Sir, this so convergent is the limb super and limb So this must be same as the limb n of TNF. Agreed? So, 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 so in other words, since that's a convergent sequence, so we know that for a convergent sequence, limb soup and limb n for same at let me write more explicitly limb nth of p and f okay and obviously I can estimate this t and f by the norm of t and actually so the limb in is it, its place actually so it's not going anywhere I can just estimate this by uh, limit of TNF. Is it making sense? You know, the saturation point has reached now. <laughs> okay, you can't see because of the board. 
if the camera is coming, if the camera is coming, go home and then see it again actually. <laughs> yeah, maybe you guys can sit here actually. Okay, how much time do we have? Okay, so, so what we showed uh, that's 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 Sir, what the. Uh, that when TNF converge, then converge karega. So, isko simply hum aise nahi keh sakte ke. No, 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 So, so that's Banach's Kandahas theorem, and uh, so I would highly recommend that you know get some time to read this non-convergence of Fourier series section, which is also based on uniform boundedness principle actually. Okay, so these these are some of the principles you know which can pop you know pop up anywhere at any time and while you are doing analysis. Uh, you know, 3Ds and everything, and everything. But like, so th these are the count of results that we should always have their statements in our head. Yeah, we should always have their statements in our head. And not too much difficult. Right? I think that's it.